So you know our man in the mountains, Matt Renew, but you may not know his wife, Kelly. She's been fighting a hard battle with breast cancer for 15 months. And in that time, she's had 16 rounds of chemo, multiple surgeries. She also found out that she's positive for the BRCA gene just a few months after her mother was diagnosed too. It took me a few months to, to get up the guts to go take the, the testing, but once the testing came back, um, you know, it was, it was definitely, it was a shock because, you know, not only is it, you know, fear of, oh my goodness, what am I going through, but it's also the fear of what am I passing down as well, too. Kelly and her mom are both doing well. It's great to hear that they caught the cancer early. Matt Renew joins us now from Frisco. Matt, I recently found out about your story when I talked to you in person, and I'm just so inspired by the incredible support that you're giving Kelly. Thanks, Natasha. And uh, you, you know, obviously, having gone through it too, how important that support is. But uh, from my perspective, not nearly as much as what Kelly had to go through and watching her strength going through this process, uh, but catching it early and, uh, and an amazing story that she has had uh, to be open and share it. We've done that on social media quite a bit uh, with good reason because we wanted people to see what we were going through and realize that not everything is so positive on social media, on Facebook, on Instagram all the time, and sometimes there are some bumps in the road. So we've been sharing that uh, also to get the word out about testing, uh, mammograms, early testing, and then the BRCA2 genetic testing if it's in the family. Our daughter now will go through it when she becomes 18. And so uh, it's, it's just, there are a lot of messages around this and we just wanted to get the word out. Uh, after all, so many times in our lives, we ask people to share uh, their dark moments and it only seemed fair that uh, we sort of do the same and then approach that with some positivity and hopefully get the word out. Well, Matt, we are so grateful that you were being so open about this because I know that by talking about early detecting, that's going to help a lot of women out there. Yeah. yeah, you guys rock. I'm telling you, I've been following like, you yeah. along along the whole way, and it is, uh, as you say, there's a lot of bumps, but it's very inspirational at the same time. So good for you. Thank you. And it's been a, it's been a story, like I said, that we've been really wanted to get out. And uh, I've often going through this thought. You know, Kelly's mom was diagnosed with this, and then Kelly was diagnosed with breast cancer. They both caught it early. Their diagnosis now is a great one. Uh, they've beat it and are moving on. Uh, but it's a good message to get out there. Not one that I felt so close to tell, but Kim Christensen, who is uh, an amazing journalist, one of the best on the planet, and our chief photojournalist, Chris Hansen, worked together on this story, and they've been following us through different stages of this and are going to talk about it tonight in our 10 o'clock news. Can't wait to see how the story turns out. Mm -hmm. Yeah, your journey has just been so incredible, Matt. And every time he's been in the studio here, I ask him and he's so positive about yeah. it, you know, mm -hmm. and I'm sure that there's been some tough days, but you guys have really just handled it so well. You guys are incredible. We'll be uh, we'll be watching tonight. Yes. Thanks for doing well, it. Yep. Thank you guys. Appreciate the uh, positivity and, and the love and all the support we've gotten at the station as well. So much right. love. Big Thanks. Time.